Hello everyone, welcome back to Neo 2. Let's see. Damn it. Yeah, never mind. I was trying to find the, the tip from last time uh, to reread it, but I can't. Weathered bone and bleached twig. All right. Wow, even at 900 familiarity, this thing is still better. And here the switch glaive. Hmm. Well, I prefer my current one. Sure, its attack is slightly lower. And if I level this one up, uh, increase the familiarity, it would definitely out damage. But this one has bonus to high attack damage uh, and increases the melee key damage, so I'll take it. Hang on. There we are. Usually the, the gear isn't too great, so there's really no point in looking into it in my opinion. <laughs> Let's kill this thing. That's done. Oh, I should probably switch to the... Yeah. The dual swords here. <clears throat> so that I can build up their sentience gauge. Now, it really sucks to be these guys. Even their ally tries to kill them. is doing that. I see it. Shit. Nice. 
All right. <clears throat> well, the sentience gauge is filling up rather quickly. Yeah, laugh about this, dickwad. Hang on. There we are. Oh, here it is. Sure thing, buddy. I have no idea what he was trying to do, but... You know, I wasn't just gonna let him power up. I'm not Goku. Well, maybe a little bit. Who's a good kitty? Come on, let's go, kitty. What? But there's a Kodama in there. Or is there? No, the Kodama must be under this structure. There's a shrine there. I'm guessing there's some kind of shortcut here that I can unlock. That is a big, big ass sword. This is just the, the regular <clears throat> um, the regular shrine that I already knew about. Kitty's gone. I'm sad. Well, let's at least. Um, to find that Kodama. I'm assuming it's related to the dude whose head I just blew up. for me to go down. Yeah, no, the dude is directly under here. As is the Kodama. So how the hell do I reach him? And it. Here we are. Last Kodama. <clears throat> All right. Now I can go here, heal up, and then go back up to the uh, to where the, the the last boss of this mission awaits.
magic. Ah, yes, I forgot to, uh, to prepare that jutsu. Oh, I should assign it to a shortcut. Alright, regarding level, let's see, I would need 800. And I can get 800. I can get a lot more than 800, but in particular, I can get the 800 that I need. <clears throat> right, weapon sentience is almost maxed out. Priest, headgear, servant of the gods, life recovery from purification, untouched sacred water. Hmm, not bad. Wonder that dude didn't see me. I get the feeling these are going to come in handy because of the dodge key consumption. is a Sudama. Sailor from a foreign land, so this is Williams. As for titles, Rogue Cutter, Grapple Novice, Obtain Prestige, Alright. Time to go in. The final boss of this mission is likely to be a yokai, so I'll just use the purification thingy. Okay, as expected, the dude deals a lot of damage. Oh, I uh, took me a while to actually recognize it, but this is the crow thingy. Uh, Tingu, right? I don't know why it took me so long to actually recognize it. I mean, clearly my brain remembered, as did my hands, if you know what I mean. That sounded a bit pervy, that was not the point. My point was that I was clearly dodging on autopilot because I remembered uh, the dude's move set. You know what? Why am I saving, saving the uh, the the yokai transformation? This is the last boss of the mission, so. And I think it's only fair that a bird defeats a bird.
Alright, so nothing of import here. Statues made of gold. <sighs> Such a waste of a perfectly good material. Not for construction, because super soft, but... You know, gold semiconductors, for example. Much more useful than a gold statue. Skullduggery. Does anybody actually use the word skullduggery? It's interesting that despite being, you know, so massive, its movements are very sinewy, as you can see here, while it's dancing. Tengu. Are those eyes? Never noticed before, but I think those are supposed to be eyes. Ah, right, forgot. I also met this one. Only with two eyes were originally human, or at least born of ugly human passion in some way. One eyed Oni, however, are said to be the wild, bestial side of mountain gods and local spirits personified. Hmm. Yeah, I still don't speak yokai. Alright, she's still not gonna tell me what the hell that giant yokai is doing. Or maybe she did tell me and I just kinda skipped it. If so, that's on me. Wait, does the sentience reset or something? Hmm. I'm gonna keep it, but I get the feeling that the sentience resets or something. Well, next is here, the Viper Sanctum. Hidoi Arisama Dana. So Koraju Kuasarter. Atariniwa Yostatsugun no Ningan Dagajanaku. Well, if someone killed the yokai, it's obviously the woman who attacked me, wearing a uh, wielding a switchglaive. Huh, I have three of these. That was still only enough for one level. Right, there's a Kodama up here. No. What? Where the hell is it? Is it... Yeah, I can't... Ah. I think I see the, the bowl. I definitely hear the noise at least, so it's definitely there. So 
So is sentience like just a temporary bonus or something? Alright, there we go little buddy. Goodbye. Both of you are idiots. Never let your key run out. Please disregard the fact that I have done so repeatedly. Dude doesn't even care. His friend gets uh, an arrow to the head, his head explodes and he's just like, yeah whatever, I've seen worse. Maybe his friend is like uh, one of those assholes who likes to perform pranks where he pretends to be in greater dan danger than he is. Maybe he's even an illusionist. So it's like, oh your head popped? Right, nice joke. You, you did that last week, Jonathan. Pick up some new material. Two large areas in the Dark Realm. Come on, little Kodama. There's this, and there's that. I don't think I've ever seen two of them at the same time before. Is that two or three? I think that's three overlaid... Uh, sorry. Uh, up ahead, I think it's two overlaid on top of each other. Come on. This does nothing. It doesn't add to the game in any way. Saito Dosan. Isn't that the name of the dude that I'm here to, uh, to help or whatever? Whoa! I'm afraid to fight you in your own realm. You're wrong, buddy. I need to figure out a way to get rid... Uh, get rid of those... Uh, burst shift counter thingies, notifications. Well, since my anime is maxed out, die. So the sword spoke to me. 
said that I still had to master the way of the sword or whatever. And yet, yeah, I'm pretty sure the sentience gauge is going down. Very slowly. Yep, look at that. So it is a temporary boost, which is just utterly stupid if you ask me. We already have enough temporary boosts like the Yokai Shift and. Well, a bunch of abilities we can unlock. I take the switch glaive or is this supposed to be like a, a hint of things to come to show that the the boss here is going to be one of the switch glaive wielding weirdos who tried to kill me well one of them tried to kill me Levels have certainly gotten a lot bigger. Um, so yeah, that is actually going to be everything for today. Um, I'll just level up, learn some skills if I can, slash want to. Eagle Eye. Temporary immunity to terrain effects. Ah. Oh. I was hoping I would at least, you know, actually levitate, but fine. Well, I'll wait, because uh, I do want this. The, uh, sorry, I want this, the key consumption reduction. For now, you must fight. You have yet to master the way of the sword. Alright, just making sure that I can have different goals for different things. Anyway, uh, alright, level up. Constitution to 10. Seems like a decent number from experience. So anyway, that is everything for today. As always, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you again next time.